Hey guys, how's it going? This is Lady Fantastic. Um, I am coming here. This is the morning. I haven't headed to work yet. I wanted to make this in uh, response to uh, the breakfast with or coffee and comics with Bueller. Um, it's a his topic was comic books change lives, and I'm not gonna tell my origin story. But what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna tell you a story that. Uh, that I experienced that was very um, powerful and moving to me that, uh, you know, has to do with the power of comics. Um, and it is uh, about a year or two ago, I was going through the quarter bins at this big um, media store. And there was another guy that was um, a couple of bins down from me digging through books. And, you know, um, people will get to talking and it's just like, hey, well, what are you looking for? Um, and I, you know, if I see it, I'll pull it for you. I told him I was I was looking for some specific era of X Men, and you know, he was looking for Green Lanterns and Green Arrows or something. And and so you know, we started doing that, and we would pull a book here and there if we saw something for one another. And then um, you know, he started talking about himself. Uh, he had a cane. He was a younger guy. I mean maybe in his early 40s, but, you know, he had a cane, and his mobility wasn't that great, um, and he said, you know, I, I don't get a chance to come down here often, but I always love it when I do. The last time I came, my, my wife got so mad because, you know, we were here for, like, three hours or something. He said, but, um, you know, I'm an, I'm an injured war ver veteran, and I have, a cage around my spine and his neck's fused and he was saying that in the in the winter times like uh he would be in so much pain that he couldn't move and he always got really depressed and that the only thing that gets him through the winters is reading comic books and man that floored me like I'm sitting there looking for my stuff, and this man's telling me, like, he, he's digging for his fucking lifeblood, you know? Um, and, and that was, that was just like, that was mo one of the most powerful things I'd ever heard. And, um, you know, you, you kind of, you make friends through chit-chatting, um, you know, next to other people in boxes, and you just never know their story. And, uh, that was this guy's story, and so, um, you know, I just want to kind of put it out there in the airwaves, um, because everybody's got one, um, but, you know, there's people out there that, that use these books as an escape from real pain, um, and, uh, god, god damn, we all have to take stock of our lives and, and look at how thankful and blessed that we are, and, um, I'm, I'm thankful and blessed that, I uh, am part of this community and that I even saw this show. So uh, you guys have a good one. Take care. Be safe. Bye.